would tell younger me Take the time that you need just to breathe Back then when we never had a worry We were so naive When I was a younger girl I wasn't so hardened by the world Why did I wanna be older? Whatever happens is gonna happen I can't believe I grew so cold We spent our whole lives Wanting to just grow up Can't turn back the clock I used to have so much love Now I'm so sick to get by I used to think the limit was the sky My imagination seemed to fade away And I know I've seen better days Wanna be innocent again Seen too much and I've lost a lot of friends Never like to watch my tongue Said what I wanted Good afternoon everyone Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new to my channel if you are new my name is Natalie I am a senior at the University of North Texas and I'm majoring in accounting today is Tuesday September not September it's October today is uh, Tuesday October 6 and it's 11 a.m. right now I just got off a zoom meeting with my professor for my tax class and um, we're just going over my exam to see what I missed, what concepts I struggled with and everything. So for the most part, uh, I did pretty good on the exam. I'm not sure if I said this already, but it's going to be a college day in my life video. I'd love for you to hit that subscribe button to join the family. It just helps me out overall and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Also hit that little post notification bell so you guys get notified on when I upload a new video. Um, but like I was saying, for the most part, I did pretty good on my tax exam. I got a 78 and I knew most of the questions. So there was 40 questions on the exam. I missed about six, I think six or seven. Um, and they were just like, I think four of them were like minor mistakes. Like I just. I guess made the question harder than what it actually was and then the other like two or three um were like actual mistakes because i couldn't figure out how to work out the problem but uh so the zoom meeting was great um i found out that he might actually drop one of our lowest book smart assignments and a homework assignment and then possibly a quiz so if you guys saw my last vlog, I talked about how I missed my chapter six book smart assignment. Um, so I got a zero for that. So I talked to him about that today and he said he will possibly be dropping a lowest grade on that. So that's good to know. Um, for the most part, he said I did pretty well. Um, I got like a question above average on what most people get on the first tax exam. So that's good to know. Um, I have not eaten breakfast or like done anything. I literally rolled out of bed at 9.45, made my coffee, drank water, and got on my Zoom meeting. I originally set my alarm for 8.15 this morning because I was going to do a workout and kind of just start my day early, but you guys, I'm dragging so hard today. I snoozed my alarm and I went back to sleep until my alarm hit at like 9.40 and then that's when I jumped out of bed so that's how my day is going I am dragging so bad but I'm gonna try and be productive today and just get a lot of stuff done so I'm getting very hungry like I said I have not eaten breakfast um, I made my to-do list this morning so that's what it looks like today I have my tax class um, in about two hours, 
actually an hour and a half so i'm gonna eat breakfast start getting ready and pack my backpack and then i'll talk to you guys later i hope you enjoy this video and i'm gonna go eat breakfast can't decide when i feel your vibe i'm lost it's hard being me when i know that i cannot i was like a west side rider vibing on the west side with us we got two blunts right with us we just smoke if you want we can live if you want reason to stay So here is my outfit of the day. Just wearing this Tyler's shirt. It's like a hot pink color. Lululemon Align leggings. And then um, my black and white Vans. And I'm going to head to school now. Because I'm running late. So I just got to this coffee shop that I always go to. It's the Sweetwater's Coffee and Tea. And I got out of class um, like five minutes early. But I am feeling a coffee because I just feel like super draggy today. Like, I don't know. But um, so I'm going to go grab a coffee and head home. I also need to stop at the bank on my way home too. So... That being said, we're gonna get a coffee because I need it. So oh, hot. I hate wearing these masks. Like, I literally sweat all like on my face. Okay, got my ice vanilla latte with almond milk half sweetened it's like my go-to order all the time no matter where I go Woo, that's strong there we go because I didn't mix it yet I got like straight espresso on my first sip so that'll wake me up all right, uh, next stop, the bank. It's 2.15 right now. All right, I just got home like 15 minutes ago and I ate like a little snack type lunch kind of thing. I had some Ritz crackers and a tuna packet. I feel like that's been like my go-to lately just cause it's so simple and an easy way to get some protein in and then i just have a bowl of grapes here that i've been munching on and then my iced coffee so i have like a little dilemma so my brother's tennis game is uh today and his tennis games are normally on tuesdays and i want to go but it's like 30 minutes away and if I only go, I'm probably just gonna stay for like an hour and a half or two hours and then come back home. But, so I wrote on my planner like stuff to do and I don't have any homework or anything due tonight. Basically all that stuff that I'm doing that's on my planner is um, stuff to like be ahead for the week, so. Like, I don't have my advanced accounting class until Thursday at 2. So, technically, I have tonight to watch the lecture and tomorrow and Thursday morning. So, I don't know what to do. Um, until then, I'm just going to chill here. Um, I uploaded a video. So, what is going on with my laptop? So, I did an update on my laptop and, like... It is so weird now. Whoa. So 
so I have this little October um, monthly calendar screen that I got from Google. And so this like task bar down here used to be black, but now it's white. So um, that's like the only minor thing I see so far. Yeah, this is white now instead of black. So I don't know if I can change that or what, but. So I made the spontaneous decision to go to my brother's tennis game. It's 4.07 right now. Um, I finished lecture one of chapter six and I started lecture two and then that's when I made the spontaneous decision to leave. Um, fun, I know. So his lectures aren't like what you think they would be. So he doesn't actually post lectures of him talking he literally just posts like a few powerpoint slides and then he like talks over the powerpoints so he breaks up the like the chapter into like three or four lectures and just talks about like the key um topics that we need to know but with that being said, um, the first lecture I finished, there was literally four PowerPoint slides in that lecture. So that's why I finished super fast. And these are my notes for lecture one. So this is the chapter. And then here's just my key topics that he discussed in lecture one. And then... I kind of started lecture two, but not really. So, with that being said, the reason why I'm breathing heavy is because I just finished shaving my legs. So, I've been like running around my room trying to like <laughs> get ready to leave. But I just changed into shorts, and I'm just gonna wear the same top because I don't care. I just changed into shorts and shaved my legs because it is like 86 outside so it's warmer and I just feel like wearing shorts so I'm going to pack up my grapes and my coffee and everything but I'm gonna leave my camera at home the only thing I have left to do tonight clearly I'm not gonna work out today that's a joke <laughs> The other thing I have left to do is chapter 6 review questions. When I get home, I'll finish watching lectures 2, 3, and 4. Okay, so we just got home from the game. It's, it's 7.34 and I'm actually glad... I went because it was so worth it it was a good game and my brother played awesome so now we're just like prepping for dinner we have leftovers from yesterday which is like an Armenian dish it's I guess in English it's a green bean stew um, and yeah I'm excited to eat because I'm starving and I'm opening up my laptop to continue on to lecture too Abby, did you miss us? Huh? Okay, so before I eat dinner and finish doing my lectures, I really want to open up about something that I talked about um, probably a few months ago or maybe a few weeks ago. Um, it's a very sensitive topic and it's something that is super 
like important right now it's a huge situation for those of you that don't know i am armenian and lebanese so my mom is lebanese born in lebanon and my dad is armenian born in kuwait for those of you that don't know which i'm not sure how you guys don't know if you don't know because it's all over social media um i think certain news channels have talked about it um but there is a huge war going on in my country right now due to Turkey and Azerbaijan. They are tag teaming and trying to take our land, trying to do an ethnic cleansing. So for those of you that don't know, 1915, there was an Armenian genocide. The Turks completely killed, raped, all kinds of horrible things and they killed 1.5 million armenians in 1915 april 24th armenian genocide so now in 2020 there is another huge war going on in armenia the turks are trying to like i just i i literally it breaks my heart because if armenia loses this war we might be the last generation besides like our kids like if I grow up and have kids we might be like the last set of Armenians on this planet and we will lose our country which is terrifying if you look at the map you'll see that Armenia is in between Turkey and Azerbaijan so I have been posting a lot of information on my Instagram you guys should go follow me because I post a lot of things on Instagram um, that's like my most used social media so I'll link my Instagram name right here and and in the description down below as well so I have ways to um, help Armenia and um, you guys can go click on those links you can donate you can sign petitions you can there's a lot of different ways you guys can help also another huge thing that breaks my heart is we are completely outnumbered by Turkey and Azerbaijan. So between Turkey and Azerbaijan, their soldiers completely outnumber our soldiers. And on top of that, we have lost multiple soldiers, especially young soldiers recently due to the missiles and attacks and explosions and everything like that. If you, if you don't know what's going on, please be open-minded, support if you can educate yourself on what is going on there are a lot of other situations besides the blm movement besides the fires in australia besides the bombing in Le lebanon like i that was terrifying to me because i have family that lives in lebanon so um if you didn't hear about the bombing in lebanon or the explosion i'm really surprised if you haven't heard about that because that was like all over social media and the news so um, that was also devastating to me as well um, because my mom was born in Lebanon and my grandma is from there as well. So that holds like the place in my heart and my family's heart. So like I said, I do have family that lives in Lebanon. So keep them in your prayers. Keep Armenia in your prayers. Support if you can and educate yourself. Be open-minded. Realize that there are other important things going on in the world as well. just washed my face brushed my teeth took out my contacts um and then i just crossed off everything on my to-do list for today so i was able to get everything done watched my lectures um did my chapter six review questions and on top of that i did an additional assignment that i didn't add on my planner 
So I added that and then crossed that off. So um, let me show you. So, so um, I had my Zoom meeting this morning, had my tax class. And then, like I said, I needed to watch chapter six lectures one through four and then take some notes, which I did on my iPad, like I showed you guys earlier. I did not work out today. That did not happen because I went to my brother's tennis game. I just finished chapter six review questions. There was only five questions to answer. I uploaded my video this morning and then I did. So I recently like just added this, which is why it's not highlighted, but it should be highlighted purple for my technical writing class. So I had to submit a interview um, question assignment and then respond to two of my peers in the class. So let me show you. So I actually typed up my peer, or not my peer, but my, que my interview questions yesterday, which was Monday. If I can find it. Okay, so it's answering interview questions. So I have mine typed here. Basically, he just had a list of questions and then we had to answer them. So these are the questions he asked. I don't know why it's blurry. And then, um, so everyone is posting their response in the discussion. So I posted mine yesterday and then I just now did two peer responses so you basically just respond to two of your classmates and give your opinion on their discussion posts so i did that that is done ignore these little sticky notes i had these um written down from my zoom meeting this morning with my professors so these are just the two uh, math problems that i struggled on on the on my tax exam um so i worked them out on the side while I was looking at my exam on the Zoom meeting. So I just have these here because I don't know where to put them yet. So ignore that, but I got everything on my to-do list done. So that's awesome. It is 10.50 right now. I'm going to end this vlog right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this college day in my life. Um, I hope it was a little bit different than my normal vlogs with everything going on. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe because that helps me out. And I would love for you guys to just be part of the family, watch this channel grow. You know, we can all be one big family together. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video because I'm going to go to sleep. Good night, guys.